My father's father killed himself, and my father was only a child when he found him hanging from a mango tree. My great-grandmother tried to love the death out of him, but he was a man, and well, you know how men are. He started drinking more and more than the Civil War struck in Salvador like lightning, and he was tortured by soldiers. He never told me, but I saw the scars. Saw him crying to himself. I would ask what was wrong, and he would say, I didn't deserve to know. And this is manhood, isn't it? And being a woman is being an apology, right? It's turning the other cheek. My mother is a saint. She is rushing home at 10 o'clock because her husband needs dinner. She is tears over the sink and a tender good night. She is the girl three different men tried to push themselves onto. They couldn't help but want to take. Didn't need to ask because her beauty was all the yes they needed. My father was one of these men. Told her, you are not leaving here before being mine. And then she was him because she figured it was time she belonged to a man. Nine months later, there I was. And I am hers. Didn't it all work out?